No, hold on. What is it? What did I say? It's cheating. What? Oh, yeah, yeah. I've been lately, I've been thinking it's cheating really a deal breaker because I want to eventually get into a relationship and I want to be me, you know? I don't think cheating is a deal breaker if the relationship is fresh. No. Yeah. It can't be fresh. No, no. Cheating is a deal breaker if you just cheat off the top. But I'm saying if you end up, you've been in a relationship for four, five years, the pussy's starting to look the same, you know, y'all been on and off, I think... Every man should have two chances to cheat while in a relationship. I mean, you got two chances to get some head, have some sex, but that's just it. Women, you get a few chances to go out on a date, text or call. You can't suck no dick, and you definitely can't have sex with nobody. No, no, no. Women, of course, it's, it's double standards. We already know it's double standards. Women, you cannot do nothing. Men, we can because we cheat with just... Thinking with our dick. We don't cheat with our heart. Women, you cheat with your heart. And it hurts. Is cheating a deal breaker? No. It's, 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 it's difficult to be in a relationship. I mean, shout out to all those people who don't cheat. You know, you guys are dope. But sometimes we slip up. Remember, God is the only perfect person ever involved with this in life. You know what I'm saying? We're not perfect. As humans, we're going to, you know, make some mistakes. So, hey, Reed, is cheating a deal breaker? Is cheating a deal breaker, Reed? He don't know. He said he don't know, but he's smiling. So, I mean, I just feel like everybody should at least have one get out of jail free pass. But don't do it on purpose. It just has to happen. Maybe, you know, no, I don't know. But you get in the comment section and you let me know it's cheating and deal breaker. Am I sound, do I sound stupid? You know, I mean, am I getting somewhere? You know, if you, if you first start a relationship, of course, you know, it's fresh. You shouldn't be cheating. So let me, you know, you shouldn't be cheating. But if that, you in that long, dragged out relationship, ups and downs, you might walk into a Walmart and see something. Obsessive, aggressive cheating is bad. But if you just do it one time and you beat yourself up and you realize that ain't what you really want to do, you made a mistake. Alright, I'm done.